ओके वट इज अवन दिस इज कैन हेयर वेलकम बैक अगेन टू टेक कर यूट्यूब चैनल मी ओ आई थर्टीन हैंड्स ऑन विद ट्वेंटी वन पॉइंट वन टू पॉइंट टू सेवन वर्शन विच इज़ अवेलेबल फॉर रेडमी नोट नाइन एस और बेसिकली रेडमी नोट नाइन प्रो बेसिकली कोटाना इफ यूर यूजर ऑफ कोटाना यू कैन इंस्टॉल दिस फील्ड आई नॉट कॉन्शियर विद इंस्टॉलेशन प्रोसेस अनफॉर्चुनेटली एंड आई विल नॉट रिकमेंड यू इंस्टॉलिंग दिस But if you still want to give it a try, the link for that one is in the description. The version which we are using here, of course, is MIUI 13. But the best thing is, and actually, quite interesting, as it's based on Android version 12. First time using a MIUI based on Android 12 in any of my devices seems quite interesting. Of course, it does not include any Android 12 features like Google Pixel has. But yes, it's MIUI. The cyber security patch is included, and of course, it's supported ROM. So yes, bugs were expected. Bugs are already there, and uh, is still want to give try. You can. The things is these are these are the default things, and UI yet sector the control center is not changed in this one. If you don't know, I made a video on MIUI 13 first look, so you can go and check it out. The things which you get in MIUI 13 almost same here with this one too. It's based on China, of course. In China, MIUI 13 is released, so yes, don't expect Google Apps etc. But yes, you can install Google Apps and Google Play Store, Magic etc. I will try to provide the link for the XDA post, and all thanks goes to the developer, and the link for that one is already in the description. option one quite interesting thing which i have noticed after using it you can see the game turbo of course we have the balance mode we have the performance mode but if you able to see we have the voice changer available that's actually quite interesting as i previously mentioned no google apps i have installed and i was having some issues there so that's why i'm not sure about if it is working fine or not but voice changer is included you can fool your friends if it is not working for you and if it is working enjoy this thing other things if you move on to for example other options the options are working fine pretty fine actually here for example you can see gallery editor and yes if you are using sd card i was having some issues with sd card i'm not sure if you were if you will have or not but in my case i'm having some issues i tried creating folders and sectra it was not working for me for example selected this folder allow and it was still not able to to get those permissions etc but if we move on to the gallery let me show you one more thing in miui 13 gallery or the latest gallery you also have a new feature which i was not able to show you in the miui 13 video but let's give it a try let me show you here for example click on okay click on okay it will show me something this warning something like that now if i move on to this option for example this if i move on here and these options you can see we have the protective watermark option available you can use any kind of watermark for example do not copy and you can see this is how it is looking like this looks quite good and quite interesting one and the first time this feature is available even though i haven't tried out this feature in any other version like me with 12.5 beta versions or me with 12.5 enhanced version that feature was not there but in this we finally have you can see the watermark is there and that looks quite good and you can see this is what we have me with 13 Of course according to Xiaomi this update is a pre-release so the control center is not implemented yet but maybe in the upcoming updates you might see that but let's hope by the way this is not official version for the Redmi Note 9 Pro or Redmi Note 9s users so yes this is a portable room of course bugs were expected even usb transfer is not working i will try to list the bugs available or as i previously mentioned you i will provide you the xda post link that would be very helpful for you if you check out the video toolbox that's also included and the dolby atmos is there which is of course not working things which are working and things which are not working all the things are already available make sure to check out that don't comment and don't complain about things which i have not shown you because this is not good for daily driver in my opinion if you still want to give it a try you can the security app of course this has the china options available for you also if you move on to the additional settings you will be able to see the memory extension feature at 1 gb of ram which will definitely not work for you same like that we also have the refresh rate option available that looks quite interesting one if you move on to the special features you have some sidebar related things which means the new options at least uh, which were inspired from me way 13 is present there everything else i've already shown you if you want to give it a try link is in the description these were things i just want to let you know i hope you like this video thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video over the edge feel like i'm floating through the edge